has Embiid surpassed Jokic as the best player in the world? Well, I'll start with this. Embiid, without a doubt, is the most dominant player in the world that we've seen since Shaquille O'Neal. Has he surpassed Jokic yet? I don't know. He still has some work to do uh, there because, you know, Jokic is obviously, you know, two-time MVP, came off an NBA championship. He's also gotten his Denver Nuggets to the Western Conference Finals twice. In terms of Embiid's performance, heck of a regular season guy, but we still need to see him do that in the playoffs when the bright lights are on, right? He hasn't been able to get his team out of the second round, and that's a big thing for me. But you don't want to discredit him. You know, he's averaging 36 points in 34 minutes, so I think Nick Nurse has done a great job of just untapping him, unlocking this, this new level of Joel Embiid's dominance. And both of these guys have superpowers, right? Jokic really picks you apart with the assists, just about nine assists per game uh, right now in the NBA. And obviously Embiid, his dominance is, on, is through his physicality. And after you play Joel Embiid, everybody has to go to the ice bath. We've seen him put up that 70 points against San Antonio Spurs. And the way he did it, just really getting into the body of his defenders and just displacing them, moving them out of the way. And then his ability to shoot from the free throw line, the mid-range game, through both of these players, we're seeing the evolution of the player. We're seeing the evolution of the big man. But I still got to give that nod to Jokic, um, waiting to see MB take that step, take that leap in the playoffs. If you look at his numbers, they've taken drastic steps back um, through the playoffs, whereas Jokic is take, taking steps forward. But I do believe, I firmly believe that both of these guys are going to change the way that the NBA drafts and evaluates players. The reintroduction of the big man. If you want to get out of the West, you've got to get through Jokic. If you want to get out of the East, you've got to get through Embiid. But right now, I still got to go with Jokic. Embiid has some work to do, and it's going to be in the postseason.